You better have your energy right if you're going to be in the room, Choice. Honey, come on in this room. Baby, I missed y'all. Come on in here, and when you get in here, hit share. Choice. Choice will be joining us periodically through the night. Oh. I said, come on in oh. the room. I come on in the room. Hey, hey Jesus is my doctor. Uh-huh. Writes down all of my prescriptions. Yeah. Bring me all of my medicine in my room. Honey, come on in this room, baby. I miss y'all, and when you get in here, hit share. Look, look a little bit different tonight, because I said I'm going to try something. See if y'all can see what's going on here a little bit. So y'all can see a little something, and we can work it on out together. Baby, come in this room. Y'all... Oh, I miss y'all. Child, anything is liable to happen tonight. Child, because I feel so full. So many great things have been happening. But I sure enough miss y'all. Ooh, what's this? Child, get on in here, okay? Thank you. Hey, Latrice, thank you. It feel good to be back in the room with y'all. Honey, come on in here. Honey, I got all kind of songs in my spirit tonight, Okay? All kinds of songs and things. Honey, y'all know I be singing that come on in this room. And I mean it. I mean, come on in the room. I come on in the room. Hey, hey. Come on, Madison, Wisconsin, Marco. Jesus is my doctor. Rise down all of my prescriptions. Brings me all of my medicine in my room. Boom. Let me rinse these off. Hold your mute. I'll be right back with you. I say, come on in the room. I come on in the room. Hey, hey. I love y'all. How is y'all doing? Where is my paper towel? Baby. When I tell y'all, honey, I missed y'all something terrible. I said, we is family for real, honey, because I get the itching and stuff. When I don't see y'all, be like, what is they doing? Honey, uh, what they got going on? Ain't nobody checked in and told me nothing. Where they at? Then I checked my inbox, and y'all have been checking in, and I appreciate you. Honey, y'all see this hair? Okay, let's stop. Okay, let's stop and talk about it. So, early today, mm -hmm, I had been washing my hair, and I... Thought to myself, I said, Self, she said, girl, what's going on? I said, um, when the last time you done combed through that hair, okay? Uh, you've been working out right much, sweating and things. When the last time you took that conditioner, let it sit in there and really comb through that hair? And she said, girl, you know, mm, can't really remember. I said, mm, -mm. Uh, you got to do better. So I took a comb, combed through that conditioner, sat in that shower and combed that thing out and brushed it on back. Let the conditioner, you know, let it rinse out real good. And when it started drying, something in my spirit said, girl, put a little part right here on the side. I don't know. That wasn't from the Lord. Because when I put that part, it won't look in all the way right. But now, look, it's a little piece of hair floating through the air or something. Now that part just sitting in there. She just sitting in there and said, oh, I'll do my part. <laughs> so now she leaned into the side. You know, I should usually be front and center. But now, right now, she... She uh, leaning on to the side, leaning, leaning, safe and secure from all in all, leaning, she leaning, okay? So tonight, I might just hold my head this way, um... So I don't throw nobody off. I mean, I try to come back right here with it. Just in case anybody got vertigo or any ear infection. This might make you a little dizzy tonight. If it do, I'm sorry. Okay? But that's the disclaimer. I threw a part in there. I thought I was doing something deep and special. Threw a deep part in there and it didn't quite come out right. I, I'm sure whatever it was I was trying to do, I'll be able to master it. But the day won't the day. I didn't have that type of time. Anywho. Here I am. 
We live and we in color. Okay? Now tonight, bear with me. Because you know, when the spirit moves me, I do things. And I told myself, I said, girl, honey, you showed out in North Carolina. You know I went home, right? Just give y'all the recap. You know, I've been moving and shaking. Was down there in Atlanta, came back home for about a week. Shot up myself on down there to back home to North Carolina. Well, I just got back yesterday, right? Now, honey, I love home. I do. I love my hometown of Eden, North Carolina. But, baby, we got work to do down there in the vegan community. Uh, wouldn't have been so bad, but my sister is remodeling a kitchen. Tasha, I love you. This ain't your fault, okay? Uh, but because she remodeling, I couldn't do no cooking in there, all right? Um, so I had to fend for myself. And for those of y'all that know me, you know I'm not a eat a salad every day girl. I do like a salad, but I don't want it every day, and I sure don't want it when I'm on kind of a vacation, okay? Um, so we went down to the Elizabeth's, which is uh, used to be one of my most favorite places to go when I went home pre-vegan uh now i realize maybe uh it ain't that great to me no more i mean i got a veggie hoagie but i couldn't get no mayonnaise because they don't have vegan mayo so it was just the bread and the veggies and a little bit of olive oil on the veggies still was kind of dry going down uh had some french fries baby if i eat another fry baby i probably turn into a fry guy Understand what I'm saying? Uh, had a little too much of that. Then I ate more French fries. Um, did I tell y'all that I ate fries? I don't know if I had mentioned that part or not, but I did. I ate some French fries. Um, had a, a fajita. Now, that was good. El Perel, baby, on Highway 14 right there. Y'all doing all right. They had a zucchini fajita uh, with peppers and onions and things. Very good. That was good. Them beans and rice was right on time. Needed it in my life. Uh, Y'all know I'm not a big rice person, but I ate it. I, I ate it on Friday night. Yes, I did. Um, also, I wrapped it up in those flour tortilla wraps. Did. So, bread on top of bread. For breakfast, I had a Subway sub full of veggies. But bread again. Uh... And did I mention I ate french fries? I don't know if I told anybody I had french fries this weekend when I was there. Ate, I ate french fries. Um, and uh, all I know is uh, I had right much stuff that I did not need, uh, that did not benefit me uh, at all. When I got back, I said, I know that my hair is going to be big today because it's right full of carbs, okay? Which led me to... Making this lasagna tonight. I said, I, I want a little uh, lasagna, but I want it to be right flavorful. And I know I don't need the pasta. Okay, I don't need that. So we're going to make it the pasta out of zucchini. Right? Ain't y'all done seen that? And then look, got right fancy. Look what I got. Got me one of these, uh, what you call it? Blade, fruit blades, whatever you want to call it. I got that. Oh, Y'all, I got fancy while I was gone. Honey, look, honey, got me some new knives. Honey, Walmart special. These is called uh, Farber Wear. Thank y'all. Very good. Zucchini. I feel like I'm burping. Did I burp? Even if I didn't do it out loud, I did it within, and I apologize. Excuse me. Honey, how is y'all doing? Okay? So, anywho, did y'all just see? Can y'all see this going on right here? See, I put my, y'all know I got my box right here, right? I got my box. Don't get brand new. Ain't nothing, ain't a whole lot changed now. I got some new knives and I got this little blade thing. But y'all know this box is still under here, my, my baguette box. But I put my cutting board on top of it. So, um, so y'all can see stuff. See, I lost my train of thought for a second. What was I looking for? Anywho, can y'all see it? Terry, I did. I had some french fries. I forgot to tell y'all that I had fries. Because if I didn't tell you, I wanted to tell you, I ate some fries. So, anywho, today I've only had uh, a coconut water smoothie and, and a little bit of a little raw salad earlier. Because um, I know how to detox my system right, right good, okay? 
But then I said, the temperature dropped in here in L.A. I don't know if we brought cold weather back from North Carolina. It must have been on the tail end of the plane. Because uh, it was raining and cold um, down in North Carolina while we was there. And now I done came home to L.A. And it's 60 degrees and been drizzling on and off all day. I said, somebody must have checked it in on the plane because it's here. We must have brought it back with us. So that made me want comfort food, right? And I thought, ooh, do I want some soup? And I said, no, I'm going to make some lasagna. But I'm going to make it out of zucchini. I'm going to throw some peppers in there, red, green, yellow peppers. Uh, we're going to throw some garlic, little garlic. Uh, we're gonna, look, throw some little, little mushrooms. Going to throw some mushrooms in there. Going to throw some, um, what is it? Oh, oh, my petite diced uh, garlic and olive oil tomato. We're going to do that. And I bought these, but now that I done took it out, I got right confused. Have y'all had these? These are tu sweet herb, Tuscan savory grounds. I don't know. We're going to try them out. Y'all done tried these before? Have you? Nicole, you said, what's the name of the lipstick that I wear? Oh, thank you, girl. Um, mm. Honey, I didn't have that thing so long, I can't even tell you. But I know that it's cheap, okay? Uh, it might be wet and wild. I don't I don't know. I know it ain't expensive um, because I got it at the right aid. But thank you. I'll look at it and try to find out for you if the, if the name of it is still on the bottom. You know how you have stuff for so long it wears off. So, anywho, we're going to do this. Because y'all know y'all get me to talking. Next thing you know, time to pass and we ain't made nothing. So already now, oh, y'all see a whole lot of ceiling? Hold on, let me see if I can, because y'all know what I got. I got y'all on my little um, stand, and I can't move it but so much without it uh, throwing the camera. See, that might do. I ain't got my other thing. Hold on, let's see. Hold your mute. Where am I? Uh, look, y'all, I'm going to have to go back to the, old, to the original. What did I do with her, though? What did I do with her? I can't find it right now. In the midst of everything, I'm going to find my old little um, cup that we used to use so I can angle it down. Because this one right here, the angle, it don't angle down. But I got some more, a little kit coming in the mail. Won't he do it? Won't he? Did. Honey, did do it and will do it. And will do it for all of us. So, anywho, honey, what have y'all been doing? We're going to get this thing together right now while we talking. Okay. Why are we talking? Honey, y'all see this? I got a three-pack at Walmart of these. Uh, one do straight lines like this right here to your zucchini. Right there. One do it like that. One of them do some little ridges. Uh, and one of them do something else. I don't know, but it was three of them in there for $4, I believe. So I knew that they had to do something, right? So anyway, I'm going to cut these up. Choice Brown. You want to say hey to the folk? Honey, come on in the room, Choice, and tell the folk hey. Oh. Hey. Ooh, what, what was that? Oh, Somebody pray for Choice, okay? <gasps> She's been going through right, right much lately, okay? She... Hey, Choice. Choice, you got a song in your spirit. <laughs> Not the song you was dancing to. Because <laughs> I don't know what that song might be, child. Honey, Choice well, was doing cutting. Ain't it cutting good? Yeah. Honey, got it at the Walmart today, girl. We did good. Choice told me to buy this other thing. Uh-uh. Yeah, you did. Yeah, she, because it was... She looks... told me to buy something that I would have had to hold like that. I told her that was not... That ain't what I wanted. I wanted something simple. Okay? What's wrong with your face? Oh, that's better right there. Cause <laughs> for a second, I thought that you was frowning at me. I wasn't frowning. Oh, okay. School is almost out. What you got planned? Oh, choice. You want to answer that? Or, or are you talking to me? What I got planned? Yes, pray for her. Yes, y'all. Pray for choice, honey. Pray for her, honey. Pray for her. <sighs> Natalie, tell your husband I said thank you for uh, sending you on in the room with us. Honey, y'all. Somebody said, bruh, bruh, snake. What that mean? I'm lost. Me too. Hey, Kentucky. Hey, Mary. Honey, my boy's about gone. I been hollered so much this weekend at the graduation. Honey, did y'all see my pictures in the video from Talia's graduation? 
Honey, so proud of her. She, she did so me. good. Hey, Charles, my daughter Morgan loves you. She sent you a gift. Oh, oh wait, is that? Didn't we get something before we left? But we had, we had to, we was rushing out. Oh, a t-shirt. t-shirt. Yes, go get it so you can shout out Morgan. Is that who it was from? Was was it a t-shirt? We we get so many things. Was it a t-shirt that Morgan sent for Choice? If it is, let let us know. Go Choice. The, the God is dope shirt. Yes, yeah, it said God is dope. Now the, the the one thing that Morgan should have sent her is a magnifying glass. See if she can find it ah, in that room of hers. Mom. And that room looked just like Theo on a Cosby show. Hey, Choice. What you? I thought you had went to your room, baby. What's going on? I know you sitting here talking about me. Oh, honey, that fake cry you doing right there, girl. That's the one that they never, never helped you. Mama ain't never fall for that one, honey. You still trying to use it. <laughs> Pertina, hey Dallas, you tell that grandson hello. Hey Dallas, how you doing, honey? Uh... Emma Shockley, listen to Lisa. She's telling you the truth, girl. Come on in the room. Florence, come on in the room off of work. Honey, come on in here. Okay, y'all. So, is we going to talk about the uh, oh. zucchini? I know oh. I, I think I messed up just a little bit, but I don't want this piece. And this piece is rather big right here. But let me just, I don't like wasting them. We'll take these little pieces too. Okay, so we making a, if you just came in the room, honey, we're making some zucchini squash. Next time I do this first, honey, so it won't take up too much of the time. Because y'all get to talking and stuff. Yeah, hold on. Let me rinse this out. Choice. Huh? What you gonna do tonight, honey? You can't get the sprinkle. But they're gonna ask for the sprinkle, honey. You gotta let them know you can't get the sprinkle right now. This dripping on Excuse my food. Me. Well, this is a kitchen. I just rinsed it off. Um Darlene, thank you. I'm so excited that you in the room with us, girl. Come on in here. Honey, when you get in here, if you ain't already all oh, y'all, hit share, okay? Share this here video. Oh, I'm from Iowa. Hey, and Iowa, my, one of my best friends is from Iowa, from uh, Chino. Waterloo, I believe. What's Chino? Chino, that's Chino the, oh, Hills. yeah, you over here in California. Chino, come on through. Come on, Tampa. So, y'all, tonight, if you just tuning in, look, welcome, welcome, welcome. Wow. We making the zucchini lasagna or something like that. I, I had this idea. I know I've seen people make them before, raw or cooked. Um, so tonight I'm going to cook mine. The stove is already on, can you guess? 350, that's right. I already got it preheated to 350. So we're going to make a zucchini lasagna. And right now, I just tilt it down so y'all can see. I'm cutting the uh, lasagna, okay? Why Choice can't get a sprinkle? Cho Choice lost her phone privilege, okay? Them grades got to be right, okay? So when them grades get back up right, she get that phone and the sprinkle of Jesus. So meantime, somebody else might want to go on that sprinkle of Jesus and give it to the people. Okay? Yeah. As for me and my house. That's how we get down. All right. Um, so uh what was I saying? Somebody said something. Somebody said, Have I noticed a difference in my health and my weight since becoming vegan? Absolutely. Well, in the very beginning, because it's I I'm what, nine months in? now right at nine months in of being vegan in the very beginning of my vegan journey i lost 12 pounds in like the first i don't know maybe first six weeks or so six or eight weeks i lost 12 pounds i didn't do nothing different other than change what i was eating but because of this old neck of mine i was uh put back on steroid injections and prednisone and them steroids honey blew me right on back up and passed the 12 pounds that i had lost um, my last injection was in November, and I have not been on prednisone anymore since, when did I have to be prednisone? February. So now, I'm slowly but surely going to get this weight back on down. But I feel amazing. Honey, I, look, I feel happy. I feel clear-minded. Skin just a-glowing. I, I mean, you know, I, I feel like it's doing what it's supposed to do for me. You know, if you just tuned in for the first time, a lot of y'all may not know the reason that um, I went vegan or plant-based or whatever you like to call it in this moment. I did it for health. Um, that was my original reason for going after watching What the Health on Netflix. And so uh, my mama died at 51 of ALS. Uh, my dad's family uh, on his side 
they die very young uh, of heart attacks and strokes. And if they don't die, they they some get uh, struck with heart attacks and strokes at very early ages. And after watching What the Health, and they said that diseases are not what doctors say hereditary, is that we're eating the same thing. And for me, meat was the common denominator. So I decided that maybe becoming vegan would be the thing that could break the curse on my family. And so here I am, loving every bit of it. This is my life now. And I would not change it for nothing. I absolutely love it. I have so much fun in the kitchen, honey, to make all these new friends with y'all. And um, food be good, honey, because, you know, I don't tell no story about my food, child. But, yeah, so that's it. Oh, Brenda, baby, you amazing. Vegan for 16 years, you better work, honey. That's absolutely amazing. Honey, Kimberly, honey, that print is on is the devil. I ain't never going to take it again. I don't care if they tell me I have to. I'm not taking it ever again. I'm done with it, okay? Done. I'm done. I, I've made up in my mind. I ain't going back. I'm not getting no more injections, no more steroids. I'm done. And, and look. By now, normally, I normally would have been so inflamed and all this stuff and in so much pain. Y'all, thank you, Lord. I ain't had the pain like I usually have. By this time, like since November of having the the last injection, usually about, you know, three months in, I'm in so much pain, honey, I can't hardly get out of bed. But, mm -mm. I mean, I still have pain, but I can, it's tolerable, okay? It's very tolerable. Um, and... They was talking about having to do surgery, and baby, I ain't got to do that. Not right now. I'm not doing it. I'm, I'm hanging on in here, child. When I tell you who got the final say in things, I think, I don't know if y'all saw earlier, I posted that thing was on my spirit today. A lot of times, folk think that their situation is permanent. But, baby, I'm here to tell you that that thing is temporary. I don't care what it is you're going through. Whatever it is, honey, it is temporary. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? It will pass. Honey, if you believe, honey, all you got to do is start speaking that thing. Oh, Lord, mm -mm. this is temporary, God. I, I believe you, Lord. I know greater is coming. I know that this, this moment right here, this, this thing going to pass. I'm going to get through this thing. You got to speak that thing over your life, and you got to believe it, y'all. You got to. Uh, somebody said, what kind of knives am I using? Girl, I just said, I just got these new ones. This is called uh, Farberware, F-A-R-B-E-R, wear, W-A-R-E. Walmart special. Yeah. I liked them because they was red. And they write sharp too. Yeah. So anywho, honey, I ain't been in a room with y'all. What have y'all been up to? What's going on? Honey, go ahead. Look. Go ahead and tell somebody something. Let's encourage each other. Did I just burp again? Excuse me. What did I? Oh, I know what it was. I lied to y'all. Told y'all I hadn't had nothing but a salad. And that smoothie. I forgot the choice when we went to Whole Foods, honey. She told, she seen this dip. And she said, ooh, mama, we got to get that. And that's why I'm burping, honey. That dip had um, spinach and jalapenos in it. But let me tell you something. That, that dip tastes like Jesus himself was sitting inside that container. When I pulled the lid off, he was just in there like this on the cross. And he said, mm -hmm. it is finished. Go ahead. That's how good that dip was. Baby, I'm going to show it to y'all. I was going to wait and do a video. I might just wait and do a video. Surprise y'all with it. But honey, that's how good it was. Honey, I'm so sorry that I am in here having to chop up everything. But y'all know that's how we do. Next time, I'll get it all ready so we ain't got to do all this. But ain't we to miss each other? And ain't we family? Honey, y'all can't be, look, you can't be tired of me just yet. I just got back. Okay? We just got back in the room together. Is that all right? Hey, Flo Jackson, honey, come on in this room, child. Get on in here. Somebody said they made a scene that you said, hey, made vegan Tom Car last night. Have you tried that yet? Girl, I ain't never tried no Tom Car. Who is he? Who is Tom Car? Tell me about that. Girl, send me an inbox with the recipe. Tell me what that is. Who is Tom Car? Is that like pho? Is it a, I'm assuming it's an Asian cuisine. Honey, tell me about it. I want you to know, okay? Bianca Thomas, you said you need advice on becoming a vegan. Well, you know what I always tell folk is, figure out your why. 
Why do you want to become vegan? When you figure out your why, and if that why is truthful, and it is strong enough, won't nothing throw you off the wagon, baby. For me, it's life or death. That's how serious it is to me. And in the process, I'm learning how to not only save my life, but others. So figure out your why, honey. Maybe some people's, why, some people's why is to lose weight. Some people's why is strictly for the animals. Some people's why is just to be healthier and feel good. Figure out your why. And baby, when that why come through together, honey, won't nobody be able to tell you nothing. Won't nobody be able to tempt you with nothing. Food that you used to love to eat, baby, you can do without. Don't even bother you no more, okay? Not even a little bit. So do that. Somebody said they got a vegan truck. All right, Brenda, girl, where you at? Where this vegan truck at, girl? What city and state is you in, honey? I need to come over there. Where you at? I'm trying. I'm sorry. I'm trying to read. Mimi, congratulations on three months, girl. That's good. Congratulations. Come on through with these victories. Honey, we celebrate all victories in this room, honey. You three months vegan, honey. Celebrate that thing. Okay, y'all. So look. Right now, honey. I'm trying to I wipe these down and I had a little bit of too much water on my cloth that I wipe these mushrooms with. So now a little bit of them is a little soggy. You know, you don't have to soak the mushrooms. Uh wipe them with a damp cloth. You don't have to rinse. Rinse them heavily, you know? So, anywho, this is what we got so far. Okay, can y'all see? I'm gonna, Let me take y'all off this charger. And I'm going to just put y'all down here so y'all can see for a pair of seconds. All right, so we got mushrooms, um, peppers, green, red, and yellow. And this is our zucchini right here, okay? Um, everything else is pretty much stuff that we ain't, we ain't got to, like, chop up or nothing. Okay? Don't that look good? Honey, you cook with color, you all right. You cook with color, baby, you all right. Okay, so, uh-oh. Honey, somebody didn't put that up right. Let me get a little olive oil. I'm going to get a little nutritional yeast because I can do that if I want to. Oh, who almost let me forget the onion? You know I need a red onion in there. Have mercy on me, y'all. Have mercy. Hold on. Hold your mute. Forgot the doggone red onion. Hold your mule. Look, y'all know I get the crying. I should have put it in my chopper. Trying to be fast. Trying to be fast. Honey. Oh, oh, I got a joke to tell y'all. Let me remember. My daddy told me why I was in North Carolina. Y'all know my daddy tell me jokes all the time. So, why... Is y'all ready for the joke? Y'all ready for it? Get ready, because I want somebody to answer it. I tell the answer, though. Why did the blind man fall in the well? I'm going to say it again. Why did the blind man fall in the well? Who know the answer? Who know the answer? Honey, I'm telling them the joke that Pop out and told me. Why did the blind man fall in the well? And these eyes and sort of, I done cut that onion. These eyes. Oh. Huh? Come on now. Come on. Why did the blind man fall in the well? Somebody said it. No, but this is. Oh, yeah, I like that too. I thought about that. Come on. I'm trying to... Boys. Okay. Somebody said... <laughs> Almost. Almost. Come on. Why did the blind man fall in the well? Y'all ready for the answer? Because he couldn't see that well. <laughs> Honey, my daddy crazy. He couldn't see that well. <laughs> Oh, no. Why did yeah. I mean? Because he couldn't see that well. Yeah. Yeah, he couldn't see that well, y'all. <laughs> Honey, that's the type of weekend I had. <laughs> Honey, jokes with my uncle, jokes with my daddy. It was just a good old time, child. Good old, clean, fun, 
Nobody getting hurt. Just cutting up. Just cutting up. That's it. Okay. So, honey, I got a whole lot going on for this little pan that I'm going to put this in. So, let's pray about that. Because it's supposed to be a small one. But, oh, Choice claims she vegan now. She on day two. Okay. She said, you know, for, you know, Choice has been saying she's mixed. Uh, mixed with vegan and non-vegan because her daddy ain't vegan and I'm vegan. So, she says she mixed. Crazy as a bed bug. Okay. Um, so, anyway, she... Even my husband, he ain't here so I can tell y'all. He been saying, you know what, babe? I think I'm going to give it another try. Because, you know, he did 30 days. And now he's saying he might give it another try. I ain't begging. I ain't trying to convince. I'm just living by example. And, baby, if both of them end up being vegan, because, you know, I'm slowly converting my son without him knowing and talking to him about it, right? But, honey... What if that happened, child? Honey, won't it be so? Won't it be all right? It will. Okay, so let's use a little seasoning. So I got a little bit of nutritional yeast. And this gives it a little bit of a cheesy flavor, but it also gives us some vitamins. Um, a lot of vitamin B is in here. So uh, I need vitamin B. We all could use a little extra vitamin B, right? Here we are. So, um, and then this is salt-free garlic and herb, uh, Mrs. Dash. And look, when it's salt-free, you can use more than a dash. I wonder if she know that before they put the name Mrs. Dash. Maybe that's what she said. You can put more than a dash. Honey, that's a commercial. Do y'all see these eyes? Baby, burnt up, okay? Burning so much, they might be turning black. Am I might getting a smoky eye? Because the onion burnt it up. Yeah. So, anywho, I'm trying to read. Right. That's what I said. Hey, Penelope. Honey, ain't this nutritional yeast? Ooh, honey, this is so strong right here. You can smell it. Garlic and, mm, yes, God. Mm. Yeah. I got a feeling this is going to be all right, y'all. So, look. These crumbles, this Tuscan sweet earth crumbles, it says that. They're already pre-cooked, and you don't you don't have to do nothing to heat them up. So because this is how they look like this, um, I was gonna do just all veggies, but then I said, you know, I got these. I might as well just use them. Y'all know how I am about my coin. Um, got my new scissors. See my new scissors? They red. So I'm gonna use this too. So we're gonna just see how how it look, how these crumbles crumble. You know. They smell all right. Let's see what these sweet earth is made of. <sighs> oh, vital wheat gluten. So if anybody is gluten free, you can't use this, okay? Um, but eight grams of carbs, one gram of sugar, twenty grams of protein, six grams of fat, uh, three hundred and fifty milligrams of sodium. So we don't need a whole bunch of this, but I might just sprinkle a little bit throughout, okay? Because the serving size is three containers. So we'll try to do, that's what, cut it one, two, three, like in threes. So I just try to break it up and sprinkle it on in there. Won't that work out? So since I don't cook with salt, that's our salt right there. Uh, I might add a little bit of some uh, seasoning of something else. So what we're going to do, we're going to put a little bit, oh, we're going to use some spinach too. And I, you know, I talked to that man today. I said, uh, sir, you sure this spinach is all right? Because I, I want to make sure. I know it says organic, but it, all these different uh, recalls and stuff happening. Child, talk to me, sir. He said, yes, ma'am, it's good. I said, all right. Because I know where you work. Okay? I don't, have to, I don't want to have to come back up there now. I don't want to have to come back up there. Look, and they claim it's uh, pre-washed, but I'm going to rinse this off just because the things that's been happening. Okay? Hold your mule real quick. Look, talk amongst yourself for a minute. Oh, I don't like Beyond Meat crumbles. I, I don't like them. Um, I tried them a couple times. They don't they don't do me right inside. Um, the Gardein, I love. So that's why I said, well, let me try these. I've never had them. But I love Beyond Burger. But them crumbles crumble my feelings, okay? Hold your mule. Hold your mule.
Okay. So, y'all. You like this hair tonight? Thank you. Honey, she on a, she in a uh, lane of her own tonight, honey. She, You know, that's Donna, girl. The Donna. That's what I call my hair because it's Don King's cousin. The way she, she do things and stuff. So, yeah. Honey, I know the... Doggone it. Okay. So, let's layer this sucker on up. Okay? Well, hey, Andrea, North Carolina, girl. You family. Janice, you here in California. Girl, we neighbors. Girl, where you at? Come on over to the house and eat with me tonight, child. Honey, you in Cali? I'm in Cali. Okay, so y'all know this is my first time making this. Okay? This is my first time. I'm gonna throw a little bit of olive oil um, in the pan, in the in the baking pan. All right. And do it matter if it's wrong? No, ain't no right or wrong way of cooking. That's what I tell myself. You just figure it out as you go. And we're gonna lay these on, lay these on in there like this. And I think I might, I, I might could probably use a couple extra zucchini because you know you want it to be right thick and things, right? But we're going to see how it comes out. Because this ain't but two zucchini. See how I'm laying it in there? We're just going to lay it in. This is what I thought about when I was out today. Some said, girl, make a zucchini lasagna. That sound good. I said, girl, you sound all right. It sound all right. Okay, we're going to do that. Um, where's my garlic? Oh, okay. Let me get a little spoon. Hold your muse. We're going to take... And you know, I season as I go too. So, we throw a little bit of the nutritional yeast. Because we can do that if you want to. Throw a little bit of that on there. I'm going to take a little teaspoon or more, whatever, of garlic. I'm going to throw a little bit of garlic. Okay? This is just the, the base, the bottom. But we're going to layer it up. You know what I'm saying? Honey, I don't know how it's going to come out. Okay? 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 Yeah. Somebody said, hey, everyone tried the field roast sauce. Everyone loved it. Put barbecue sauce on. Oh, I know that's right, honey. The field roast ain't going to do you wrong. It ain't going to do you wrong. Um, We're going to put, what should we put next, y'all? Oh, cheese, because I wanted to kind of grab the bottom. So let's put a little bit of this mozzarella. So this is the cheese that I love. I love this fall in your heart. Uh, mozzarella it's, it melts so good so nice so I'm going to show you hold on hold your mute we're going to put a little bit of this on here so that it holds it together down in the bottom too like a like our crust you know just like our crust stay with me see right there and then this right here ain't nothing but some basil lightly sprinkle just a little bit and then we're going to take our seasoning that we just bought our salt free garlic and herb and we're gonna throw a little bit of that on that cheese too so when that cheese melt honey it's melting into the flavor yeah did that come out right melting into the flavor or the flavor is melting into it you know what i mean okay we're gonna throw a little bit of spinach okay we're gonna layer this thing up nicely we're gonna layer it up nicely okay because i think we probably could have used a little bit more zucchini on the bottom but it's okay because we're gonna put some more zucchini on top all right here we are yes okay um throw a little mushroom let's throw a little mushroom on here honey go ahead and throw your little mushroom yeah you can do that throw your little mushroom all right now let's take um a little bit more cheese just because i can do that because i it's lasagna and i like it to be cheesy okay we like it to be cheesy all right, throw a little bit more of that cheese on there. And then, I'm going to take, I had a little bit of garlic left on here. We're going to take some of these um, tomatoes that we talked about, the basil and garlic tomatoes. And we're going to put a little bit of that on there. You know, we can use this without even using the, um, I bought some Victoria's vegan sauce. But honey, I don't believe we're going to need it because I believe we can just use these tomatoes. But we still might put a little bit. If we want to, you can do that because it's my business. If I want to do that, I can do it. Okay? Honey, I'm trying to do this with holding this so y'all can see. Can y'all see it? Y'all see? Honey, that color will do you right. 
that color will do you all the way right. Okay? Okay. So, now, we're going to throw some these uh, yellow peppers in. A couple yellow peppers. Honey, is this... Is anybody else getting excited about this thing? Honey, I'm getting excited about this thing, child. Y'all see that? Okay, now... Uh, I'm going to throw a couple onions, but I feel like we're supposed to put the zucchini, and I believe y'all forgot. We're going to, whatever. Honey, how Blackie doing, girl? He right here laying asleep. Honey, Blackie didn't get to go with us North Carolina. He, my friend stayed here in um, house sat for us and brought his dog, my brother Nick. And they had a good old time while we was gone. I'm using Follow Your Heart mozzarella shredded cheese, okay? So here we are. So, so far, if you just got in, on the bottom, can you see the bottom? We got... The zucchini, okay? We got the zucchini. And then we got, um, what do we put on after that? We put garlic, uh, cheese, spinach, mushrooms, red peppers, yellow peppers, onion, and these uh, diced tomatoes with garlic and olive oil on them. Oh, garlic, we put olive oil on the bottom of the pan. Yes, Troy. Oh, you're cute. That's cute. You can do that. Did you tell them that I'm vegan? Honey, I told them that you had just started your vegan journey, honey. Uh, well, she ain't really... Because like you ain't got your why together. But, baby, it don't um, matter. If you want to if you wanna jump on right now, honey, I'm going to guide you the best way I can. Y'all hear her talking? I'm vegan. I'm honey, Andrew, you said I look like I'm 22. Girl, where you at? Honey, I'm going to come and hug you. Thank you, child. I told, don't it smell good, Choice? Choice said this thing smell good. So we layering it again with the with the zucchini because remember the zucchini uh, is our um, is our sauce. I mean, is our noodles. We using that. Oh, y'all want to know about the sauce? Okay, because I was using those tomatoes and I thought maybe I don't really need to use the sauce, but we want to put a little bit anyway. So this is the Victoria. Victoria. I know it's backwards. Hold on, let me see if I can flip it over for y'all. Hold your mute. Hold your mute. Tomato basil. Fresh chopped basil. Um, Victoria. Okay. I actually found this one at Walmart, but Whole Foods actually carries Victoria as well. Okay. So, yeah. We'll put a little bit in it since y'all always begging me to put it in there. Oh, y'all see how I opened it on the first try. I'm getting strong. Honey. I'm getting strong. If you didn't know, you better ask somebody, okay? This vegan this vegan strength, girl. Okay, so we're going to put a little bit of sauce on, on top of the zucchini. And remember, honey, you doing it however you want to do it. Because I'm showing up doing this however I want to do it. Because I'm just figuring it out as I go. Ain't we all together in it, figuring it out? Yeah. All us in it together, okay? So hold your mule. I'm going to show you what I done did. Hold your mule. Hold your mule, honey. Okay. So I put, here we go. I put some more sauce right there. You see it? So we put, that's the sauce. We put the sauce on the top, okay? Now, uh, let's put some more nutritional yeast. Just a little dab. You know, because that also gives it a little bit of a cheesy. Um, and we're going to put a, the Mrs. Dash. Salt free, y'all. Garlic and herb. Salt free. Um, I haven't used anything with salt. No seasoning with salt except, what did I use? That I oh, these crumbles. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to put a little bit of these crumbles. So if you're just tuning in, these are the crumbles. These sweet earth Tuscan savory grounds. We're going to put a little bit of these in there. Because they got the sodium we're going to try to keep down. So hold your mule. Honey, that jalapeno dip that I had earlier. Child, so this is about... Ain't that about a third? We're going to break that up. Hold your mule. We're going to break it up. I'm going to show y'all. I said I'm going to show you. Calm, everybody calm down. Look, everybody. Oh, these, these break up real nice. Honey, wait till y'all see it. Honey, broke up right nice in there. See that? Can y'all see it? Yes? Okay. Hold on. Let me, look, let me wash my hands, though. Um, or at least rinse them off. I forgot what else. It was something else that I had wanted to throw in there. Oh, that's what it is. 
a little bit, uh, just a little flavor of cilantro. Just a little flavor. Mix that all. Okay. So, uh, just a little pinch of cilantro in there. And that's just to give it a little, I don't know, a little extra hint of something. What is that something? Not quite sure. But cilantro just about make everything good. I promise it do. You ain't never had cilantro in your life, child. Get you a piece of it, okay? Okay? Get you a little piece of cilantro. Throw it on a taco. Throw it in some pasta. Honey, watch your whole life start getting better. Right there. Okay, let me throw some more cheese on here. Honey, why I tell you we finna eat good tonight? Mm, 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 mm. We finna to eat good. Uh-uh, what happened? Honey, what just happened? Something flashed. Was my phone ringing? Honey, I don't know. Look, is my battery low? Hold your mute. Let me, let me charge it up. Didn't something just happen? Hold your mute. Can y'all still see and hear me? Something flashed across my screen. Might have been the angels because this right here is straight from heaven. I can feel it in my spirit. Okay, so we're going to throw um, a couple more onion. Okay, a couple more onion. Uh, let's throw some red peppers in here. And green peppers. We forgot about the green peppers, y'all. Didn't even throw them in there. And some more spinach. Some more mushroom. Because, you know, mushroom is like your meat. Throw the mushroom in there. Because, see, we're getting about to the top. So, we want to just put all the things that we done worked so hard on. And let's go with some more um, seasoning. Salt-free, you can just season it up as you want. Okay? You can do that. You can do that. And then throw your more zucchini. Your, look, more noodles. Oh, actually, let me put a little bit more cheese. Honey. I know I was gonna get sun-dried tomatoes, but Choi said she wanted to eat some. And so she don't really um, like the texture of sun-dried tomatoes. Ain't I a nice mom? So I said, well, I'll use diced tomatoes tonight. But baby, you know them sun-dried tomatoes would set this thing on fire. It would, I believe that in my spirit. Okay, let's layer it up again with some more zucchini. Honey, y'all realize ain't nothing in here fattening, nothing. This thing is about as healthy. I mean, it's just it's just a bunch of veggies. I mean, we got them little faux grounds in there, but you can make this without the, the, the fake meat. You don't have to have it. They ain't fattening. It's just, you know, if you're watching your sodium intake, just do what I did. Only use a little third of it. Make it last. Okay, look, we're covering it again, okay? See that? Yeah? Okay. Um, and now we're going to put a little bit more sauce, Okay. Thank you. Yes, somebody said put more sauce. Here we go. Hold your mule. I'm going to put a little bit more sauce on there. Honey. Uh-oh. Hold your mule. And look, any vegetables that I got left, honey, going to go in my salad. Because don't think we're going to waste no vegetables. Oh, you thought that? If you thought it, you was wrong. Okay? Yes, God. Mm. Oh, my God. Y'all know what I forgot. My Parmesan, because I like to mix that in. I like to mix in this Parmesan, so I'm going to keep that on the top. So, see that right there? I'm going to mix a little bit of Parmesan cheese in there, too, because I can do that if I want to. And you can also put this on at the end. You can put that on at the end if you want. See that? I think we can do one more little layer of, of a couple things, like these mushrooms. Okay? We can put a little bit more mushroom. The rest of this little cilantro. Uh, what else y'all think before we put another layer of um, zucchini on there? Couple more onion. You believing in your spirit, honey? Ain't this, I know this thing finna. This thing right here is finna be awesome. Okay, spinach. We'll throw some more spinach on there. Anything that'll lay on down. Lay down, honey. honey when, when I tell you, we finna pray this thing into the oven, honey. I'll we'll throw some red peppers on there too. We gonna, honey, I don't think y'all are gonna understand. Do, but do y'all understand how simple this is? It's, it only took a long time because I had to cut up everything. And y'all was talking to me, making me do all that talking. Honey, production. Can y'all sometimes control the talking, all the questions, and people be do all that, making me do all that talking? Ain't nobody here. It's just me right now. 
but we speak into our production. Because you know when my show come, honey, we ain't going to have but a, uh, what'd you say, Spirit? Oh, he said we're going to have an hour. We're going to have an hour? How are we going to have an hour? I thought we were going to have 30 minutes. He said we're going to have an hour. Honey, we're going to have an hour show coming. And when the hour show come, child, I guess we will have time for questions. So y'all keep them coming. Because y'all know, throw a little bit more of the seasoning. Okay? A little bit more of that seasoning. A little bit more of this nutritional yeast. Because I can do all of this if I want to. Because it's my business. Um, a little bit more basil. Just because I want to do that. Mm-hmm. Um, what else? Oh, a little bit more sauce on the top. Just a little bit more. And honey, this thing going to get a prayer. And honey, we're going to send this sucker right into the oven. Okay? Mary Ann, honey, girl, come on over here and get you a plate. Girl, I got you. Girl, yes. Can y'all see it? Honey, when I get my uh my little other kit, because I ordered the wrong one. And when I get my other one, honey, y'all gonna, gonna really get the moving and shaking in here. Okay? Uh-oh, here we go. Honey, final touches. If all hearts and minds are clear, honey, we're gonna go ahead and throw this on rest of this cheese, this whole bag, on there. Mm. When I think of the goodness of Jesus and all he's done for me, my soul cries out, vegan Luya. I thank God for saving me. Thank God. Oh, I thank God. I thank God for saving me. Thank God. I thank God. Honey, do y'all see this? Vegan Luya, honey. Woo, baby. Mm, I feel like I forgot to put the last layer of zucchini on there. And nobody told me. Did I? Yep, forgot. Why didn't y'all tell me to put that last layer on there? I'm going to just throw it on the top anyway. And then throw a little bit of more cheese on there. Can't hurt. Because it's our noodles, you know. I was supposed to put a little bit more on there. Just a little bit. To hold everything together. Y'all got too excited. Oh, Lord. I know, Lord. That's what I'm saying. They the production. They supposed to be part of the staff right now. Now they want to act like they just the audience. Knowing we in it together, ain't we, y'all? Ain't we in it together? You see when I cut up and do stuff wrong, y'all supposed to tell somebody. Honey, ain't nobody tell you nothing. Y'all over here watching like y'all in the studio. Huh. Now I got the, what I'm going to do? Oh, now look, now I got to put some more nutritional yeast on the top. Look, some more of this right here, this seasoning, salt free. And look, now I guess I'm going to have to, I can use the Parmesan. Because we want the top to be a little crusty anyway. You know, how you had a crusty top lasagna, how your mama them be fixing it, you know? I'm going to put the cheese on the top, too. But I just wanted to put one more set of the zucchini on there. Thank you. Look. Now. Now we talking. Come on, lasagna. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Throw a little basil on the top. Because I can do that if I want to. Because it is who business? Mine. Y'all see it? Okay, final look. Let's let's take a good look. That's it on the top. Don't look good. That's what I'm saying. I feel the same way you feel, but better. Two times over. I'm trying to tell you, I feel this thing in my spirit gonna be good. Now, let's go on and say a prayer. Let's I'ma pray because for several reasons. One, because this came in my spirit, and I just thank God for giving me the thought. Uh two, because I don't know how long we should cook it. I'm going to pray that he tells me. Um, three, just because we're always supposed to pray. Let us pray. Lord, God, I just say thank you, Lord. Thank you for us being in the room one more time, God. 
Uh, Lord, I thank you for giving me this recipe in my spirit today, saying, tap, throw that thing together. And Lord, I just did that. We threw it all together. All together, we did it. Uh, Lord, I, I pray that this thing is as good as it felt in my spirit, Lord. I also pray, Lord, that uh, I put it on 350 and you tell me how long this thing should cook, God. Um, I'm feeling in my spirit about 20 minutes, um, maybe 15 because it's all veggies, but uh, should I increase the time on it, God? Let somebody be watching that or just feel it in their spirit and say, girl, turn the stove up to something, something, Lord. And, and, and somebody else will say, girl, I believe that, that, that amount of time will be all right. But God, all these things we asking in your name, Lord, amen. Okay. Okay. Um, y'all, uh, somebody was going to cover this. Um, oh honey, yeah, follow your heart, make a vegan Parmesan cheese that will make you smack somebody. It's so good. Somebody forgot the aluminum foil. I was going to cover this with aluminum foil and bake it. But I do want this top part to be a little crusty. But what if I done forgot the aluminum foil, y'all? Cool it. 45 minutes or one, or one hour. Cool it? Oh, you meant cook it. 30 minutes. Turn the stove to 400. I like that. Let's go up. 400. Uh, what if I ain't got the aluminum foil? You know, oh, we, we bake everything on 350. 350 is the resting stage for my stove. Sometimes if, when I come in the kitchen, my stove turns to 350 on its own. It just thinks that I'm coming in to cook. It just flips on the 350 and say, I'm ready. Um, so we're going to do 400 degrees for 30 minutes. And don't cover it. Don't cover it. So somebody say, don't cover it. Somebody else say, cover it. Wipe the outside off. What's on the outside? Just You mean just make sure ain't no, no type of nothing to spill out? I think we're good. Oh, on this side. Girl, thank you. I didn't even see that the peppers and stuff had caught on there. Okay. So, we're going to do that. Lower the racket. But I think it's already low in there. Showing up here. So, we're going to go with that. So, right now, we're going to go with 400. Uh, oh, somebody said put a pizza pan on top of it for the first part of the cooking. But I don't want it to get on my cheese. We gonna pray on this uncovered, okay? Somebody said four hundred is too high. It's gonna burn your food. Don't go over four hundred. How about three seventy five, and then we beat everybody in the middle, okay? Let's do that. She going in, y'all. She going in. All right. So I put her on three seventy five. Going. It's 612 right now. Y'all see I got me a Fitbit. Remember I told you? 612. But I don't know how to... Do I know how to set my timer? Honey. I told y'all we production moving up. Set an alarm. New alarm. At, um... At 6... Honey, is we gonna be on here this long? Y'all gonna hang on with me until we find... Until we get to chase it. Y'all gonna, gonna stay in the room with me that long? Yeah, check it out for 20 minutes. Okay. So, 612, we're going to say, first alarm I'm going to go off at 635. Won't that do it? That's about 20 minutes. 637. We'll say 637. Okay. I think, I, I think I'm setting it. Done. I think. Is that right? I don't know if it's set or not. And I'm still getting used to this thing. Oh, there it go. On. Not every day, just today. Okay. So, it's going to go off. And then somebody said, lower the temperature after 15 minutes. Honey, listen, I'm with y'all. So, we at 375. Um, what's your name? Theophila. I got a YouTube channel. I just don't go on there as much. Um, but I try to get, you know, upload some of my videos and stuff on there. But I'm trying to, like, start uploading my lives after I go live on Facebook and then upload them there, too, for other people. Because people have requested that as well. But I, I just love my Facebook. And I love my family on Facebook. 
too. So, but I do have a page. Look, what's the name of it? I think it's just under my name, Tab the Brown. But yeah, I got like my uh, original videos and stuff is on there when I do reviews and things. Somebody else said they got a Fitbit too. Honey, if you got a Fitbit, uh, add me on here. Let's do some challenges. Now, how do you do that? I think you put um, my email. Is it the email that you put on there? I, I did it on Facebook, though. I, I, I added it to Facebook, but, it's, but it doesn't, it's not the same email that's on this Facebook. It's my other one. So if you want to do me on, on Fitbit, if you want to join me on here, honey, send me a message. And then I send you, we'll figure it out. So either send the email or tell you to send me the link or send me your link. I forget how it works. But so we can, look, we can step together. I forgot. Let me see how many steps I have I got today. I'm going to tell you. Hold on. Let me throw this in the track. So I'm going to tell y'all. Is it ready? Choice, how is going to be ready, girl, when I just put it in the, in the stove? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Don't come here. Open the stove. I just put it in there. I just want to see what it looks like. These children. Let's see these children. Well, choice. Well, oh. Who am I dropping? Lord have mercy. What was I saying, y'all, for choice came in here? Um, this is a Fitbit. Not an Apple Watch, but it's a Fitbit. So it count my steps. Let me see. I'm going to tell y'all how many steps I got today. Choice, how do I get back out of here? I done set an alarm. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. So, all right. So, today I have had, because I, I didn't get a whole lot of steps like I normally, but right now I'm at 12,854 steps. I'd like to get fifteen to 20,000 a day, but I did a short workout today because I had stuff to do. Um, and you missed the beginning. Oh, so we went to the graduation. Look, since we got about 30 minutes to kill time and talk, don't we? Um, so my stepdaughter, Talia, graduated this weekend from Winston-Salem State University in, uh, North Carolina. And we went to the graduation and honey, when I tell you it was amazing, if, if anybody has seen, uh, it went viral, the video of the drum majors when they got accepted their diploma or they, they degree, honey, when I tell you they showed out. I loved every second of it. I just think, and look, one girl, look, a couple of them, but one girl got up there and got the shouting, honey, about whole hat blew out. You don't know what somebody done went through to get to where they, where they at. You understand that? And I say, girl, if you don't praise them, you better. People don't be understanding that. Some people be saying, oh, folk overreacting. Oh, it don't take all that hooping and hollering, honey. Sometimes you don't know how much hooping and hollering and crying that somebody had to do going through. That's why they take the time to go on and give some praise. People don't... Look, don't get me started. But it was amazing. It was so good. Um, she did great. She had so many accomplishments. She graduated with honors. It was just simply amazing. We were so proud. Um, then we had a graduation party for her on Saturday night before we left. And, you know, we had just been so proud of her. We originally were going to buy her a car. And then my husband and I said, you know what? We prayed on that thing. And God said, no, give her options. So we gave her options. And gave her, look, gave her a nice envelope with, with very good options for herself. Uh, but it went amazing. It was good. We ate. We laughed. And, honey, we did a whole bunch of crying because it was just so beautiful and everything was good. Uh, but it was good. Thank you for asking. Thank you for asking. And uh, my my little cousin, Courtney, which is my Uncle Pokey's uh, daughter, she graduated from early college. So she's a senior in high school, but she went through the early college program. So when she graduated, she graduated from high school with, with two years of college already under her belt. I said, oh, honey, you just showed out over here, child. Very good. These kids ain't playing, honey. What? Twas, twas, what? So that's what you eat, no, honey. Mushroom. Oh, okay, very good. So yeah, so we, so I got to go to her, her, my cousin, um, her graduation party. They had a little cookout. So I was just, it was just good. The whole thing, all around, was just good. Okay. 
Um, thank you, Charmaine. Charlene, honey, congratulations, girl. I know that pressure, I can only imagine. I myself did not graduate college. But, baby, I can only imagine the pressure that it must be to get through there. Okay? that's a, It's a blessing. I, I commend everybody. And, honey, when, when somebody in my family does such a great thing, honey, that requires work um, and following through, honey, I love to reward greatly for that. So, y'all deserve that when you graduate. That's amazing. Congratulations. What's in the oven? Oh, oh, Marilyn. So if you're just getting in the room, y'all, tonight we cooking a zucchini lasagna with zucchini as our noodles. They look like this. Show y'all because I got extra right here. Mm. That's our noodle we're using. Zucchini, uh, red peppers, green peppers, yellow peppers, mushrooms. We got a couple of these... Um, Tuscan savory grounds that we put in there. We use it some um, Mrs. Dash salt-free seasoning and nutritional yeast seasoning right there. We used uh, a little bit of this tomato basil uh, Victoria's sauce. Yeah. Uh, also threw just a couple uh, of these petitely diced tomatoes in there made with garlic and olive oil. We threw some regular garlic on in there. Uh, oh, we used Follow Your Heart cheese, mozzarella, and also Follow Your Heart Parmesan. Okay? Lanisha, happy birthday, girl. And we add a little olive oil. Did I say red onions? We use that too. Some spinach, honey, and a whole lot of praying. Hey, Christina, I shouted you out, girl. Uh, oh, your son graduated cat. That's amazing. First in the family. Absolutely amazing. Well, Talia, she was our first too. So, so, so happy. On my husband's side, first graduate, graduate from college. Absolutely amazing. Um, Kiara. Oh, that makes me so ha happy. Kiara Mosby. I love you, honey. Um, hey, Jazz Jumper. Hey, girl. Uh, I love you too, Annette. You can, Yvonne, you can't smell it yet? I smell it just a little bit, girl. You're going to start smelling it in, in, in just a few minutes. What am I looking for, y'all? Oh, my little container, because I'm going to put my... I'm going to sit these all right here. Uh, what else was we supposed to talk about? Huh? Oh! Nicole Brown, girl, whenever you read it, girl, send, <clears throat> send it my way, girl. That zucchini that got on in my throat. Got caught up down in there. Um, so real quick, who coming to Orlando? We got about two weeks. I'm going to be down there in Orlando, Florida, child. Roll call. I done posted the link up so you can buy tickets. Honey, come on down there with me. Hang out with me. Eat with me. Laugh with me. The vegan so simple experience. Honey, <clears throat> it's going to be good. It's going to be a good time. Who coming? Honey, who coming? Thank you, Shakira. Oh, you know what? That's amazing, honey. Follow your heart. It's right down the street. I live in Chatsworth, right down the street. And I know a couple of the people very well. I love them. Honey, if I burp one more time. Where's my water? Excuse me. Mm. Thank you, Deborah. I love you. Look, you inspire me. Oh, did I watch the... I didn't watch the Royal Wedding, honey. I didn't even... Because we were in North Carolina. So our times was all messed up. We had to get up at super early to get on the, uh, off the plane at 5 in the morning. Get out back... Because, uh, you know, we lose three hours traveling um, from California to North Carolina. We was just all a wreck. So, no, nah, child, I didn't miss the whole, the whole Royal and the Wedding. But I saw pictures. It looked beautiful. I'm so happy for them. They look so super happy. Um, somebody said, you drove Uber. Oh, I most certainly did. Honey, you didn't know? And look, we'll do it again if I have to. Don't get brand new on me, baby. Listen, I posted that, that uh, video earlier today. But I've said it many times before. 
yes, I'm an actress, okay? Um, but I also used to work a regular job. That job was killing me, okay? It was killing me here, here, just literally making me sick. I was putting up with stuff that I should have never been putting up with, okay? It took me almost, it took actually over five years for me to get up enough nerve to walk up out of there, all right? Um, I walked out of that job. I was still pursuing my acting, but I got sick because I, you know, you hold stuff in for so long, honey, stuff starts to fester, okay? Um, and so I got sick. Uh, I was dealing with a whole lot. I was depressed. Just so much was going on, all right? Um, so for like a whole year or so, I did not work. And after that, which was last year, I came up out that thing. And I was feeling great and things were, you know, going well. Um, but I still was not making money like I had been used to making. And I, um, you know, I was auditioning a little bit here and there. But things weren't really moving and shaking like I needed. And holidays rolled around, right, um, that actually... Wait a minute, is this still a thing? Oh, okay. I, my thing popped up and a little note came up. Probably because we've been on here for over an hour. Um, but I told my husband, I said, a whole lot of my friends that um, drive, that are actors also drive Uber. And they told me they're they making pretty decent money. I was like, I'm going to go drive Uber. My husband was like, you can go drive Uber. Now, mind you, you got to remember, just at, earlier that year, last year, I was on the Ellen Show. I was I was acting, doing my sketch comedy with the Amazon. I, you know, I had just starred on Switch at Birth. I had different shows and stuff I had did. But honey, listen, ain't nobody rich off of that, okay? That, that's some. I'm making money. Yes, I'm I'm making footsteps into my journey. Yes, thank you God for all of it. But I want rich. I still needed money coming in, honey. And my savings was going. I see, girl. I see you later. Girl, call me. Girl, write me, honey. It went from call me to write me to. That's what my savings account was doing. Me and you should never part. Like, it was gone, okay? So I told my husband, I'm going to drive Uber. And he didn't believe me. I was like, honey, I ain't too good. Why? Why? So I went on down there, got my car registered right on up. Honey, saw some folk in the line that knew me. They was like, didn't I see you? Yep, how you doing? Honey, is this where you sign up at? Yeah, Okay. Side right on up for that good old Uber, honey. Let me tell you something. That Uber changed my life. If I had not driven Uber, you and I would not be sitting here talking. See, when you when you going through something, you don't it don't make no sense to you, okay? But when you look back on that, oh, I had a phone call, folk, devil. Um, when you look back on things, honey, you start putting them pieces together, honey. That thing start coming together like the most beautiful puzzle you done ever seen in your life. Honey, I look back on that thing. I said, now, had I not drove Uber November and December, on December 30th, okay, I would not have been dropping somebody off on the other side of town by Whole Foods and said, ooh, I'm hungry. Let me go in here because I know Whole Foods be having these vegan options. Let me go in here and see what they got I can eat, eat for breakfast before I, you know, go do my workout and go uh, pick up somebody else on Uber, right? Went right on in there, saw that. TTLA on the daily menu and got that thing. Sat in my car on my break. Because when you drive Uber, you put yourself on break, child. You, you, you make your own schedule, right? What? Sat there and ate that sandwich and said, oh, I got to tell the people about the sandwich out of fail. Which was the TTLA. Renamed it. It was TLTA on the sign, but in my, you know, in my goodness moment, because the thing was so doggone good, I switched up the letters by accident, but in turn, changed the name. Okay? So, honey, you can't tell me that when you're going through, God don't got a plan for it. I promise you, if you just keep on moving, if you just keep on striving, if you just keep on believing, because listen, people would get in my car when I would pick them up. Honey, I'd have people crying in my car. Every day I told my husband, God got me doing this for a reason. It's bigger than me. It's bigger than me. Do you know that some of the same people that I drove in, ooh, perfect strangers, have sent me messages on Facebook and said, oh, my God. You were my Uber driver. Oh, my God. I cannot believe you drove me an Uber. Yes, I did. Baby, and if, if times get hard again, I'll drive it again. Thank you, God, for Uber, for the convenience. Okay? Listen, when I tell you if I had not did that, I would not have went in that store. I would not have sat in that car. I would not have ate that sandwich and did a video. I would not now be the brand ambassador for the vegan community of Whole Foods. 
I would not have all these different brands. I, the video, nothing would have ever went viral. In the, like, th listen, when I tell you, stop worrying about what's happening. Oh my God, why is this happening? There's two ways you can say that. Now, are you listening? Are you listening? It's two ways that you can be like, Lord, why is this happening? Or, okay, Lord, tell me why this is happening. It's two ways you can look at that thing. What do I need to learn in this moment? Why is this happening, God? What do you want me to do? Okay, let me humble myself. Why is this happening? What do I need to do? Show me, God. I'm willing to learn. I'm okay going through the struggle. But see, too many times we get so bent out of shape because we're so tired and we're frustrated and we don't want to go through it no more. Why me, God? Why me? Instead of saying, ooh, thank you, God. Mm. Ooh, why me, Lord? Now, what you want me to <laughs> There's ways to switch that thing around up here, okay? What you put out is what you get back. So I'm telling you, I will wake up and I say, ooh, God. <laughs> I will pick people up in my Uber car. And they'll be like, so, you know, I'll be like, now, how you doing? You know, because, listen, I'm a talker, as we know. How you doing? What's going on? What you doing? You know, I'm in LA. These phone calls, the devil don't want me to tell y'all this. I pick up people from all over, you know, from all other countries, because it's LA, it's a big city. Honey, you don't never know who you might be in the car with. You don't never know. So I, I let people come on in the room, in the car. Honey, what, what's going on? What, you know, what you in town for? What you got going on today? Okay, and honey, people be you know, look. My mind, I told my husband, I'm gonna get discovered in my car. That's what I told him. I said, I'm gonna mess around. I'm gonna pick up a director or a producer. Somebody gonna want to work with me. I'm gonna have me a TV show for the end of this year. I'm gonna book me something. That's what I told him. Now I didn't know that I was saying I'm gonna get discovered in my car by eating a sandwich, but I said. I'm going to get discovered in my car chance. That's why I told him. I said, God got a plan for me. I believe that thing. Honey, Uber is part of my journey. Yes, God, I drove it. Honey, yes, God. And we'll not be ashamed of it. Honey, one more thing. Look, since y'all got me running my lip on it, stop being ashamed of your temporary situation. Baby, it's temporary. Honey, if you don't tell somebody, how's how somebody going to be blessed? How's somebody going to be blessed? And I always tell people this. You're right now, somebody else is praying for. Look, you, you don't like your job. Somebody else is praying for that very same job. Huh? Them kids is working on your last nerve. Somebody is praying to have children. Do you understand? Honey, your car is on its last leg. You so tired of your car, but it's still running. Somebody is walking to work. Listen, somebody is praying for where you at. You got to be thankful in your moment. Lord, thank you, God. I ain't where I want to be, but, oh, Lord, I thank you for this moment. Somebody is trying to get to where you are. Stop beating yourself up. Stop being embarrassed about your current situation. Honey, ain't nothing wrong with that. It's temporary. Okay? Why y'all got me cutting up tonight, honey? Then I said what I said. Okay? Let me check on this. Ooh, honey. I love y'all. Wouldn't tell you if I didn't love you. I tell you, I wouldn't. You know, people always, uh, I always know who it's for and who it ain't. Because sometimes I get to talk and I'll look up on my live and all of a sudden it'll drop about 500 people or sign off. Them ain't the folk that I'm talking to. And it don't bother me not one bit. They'll get what they need. Every person that's supposed to hear what God has to say will hear it. And who won't be shame about it and who ain't ever going to stop? Not he, look, not I, no, not me, absolutely not. Um, that's right, Audrey, temporary. Honey, temporary, okay? Jessica, I love you too. Latricia, I love you. Yes, that's right. It's Latricia, it's temporary. Y'all better believe that thing. Believe that thing. Mm -mm. Don't be, do not be ashamed. Honey, your, your right now, your story might be the very thing that'll break somebody's chain off of them. You understand that? Like something that you so ashamed of, something that you holding in might be the very thing that breaks somebody free. Honey, don't look, 
breaking you free and them in the process. What last month? Has it been a month? Yeah. But somebody look when my when my system got hacked, somebody came in and deleted my videos, right? But I did a video and I said, our secrets, your secrets are making you sick. Stop holding that stuff in, tearing yourself apart inside, being ashamed. Okay? It ain't nothing. Life ain't nothing to be ashamed of. Whatever you done been through, honey, it ain't nothing for you to be ashamed about. Baby, listen, our lives, we have agreed upon this thing. Okay? That's my belief. I believe that before we came, we agreed on this thing. And we said, yeah, I do that mission. Send me on over there. And so everything you've been through, you agreed on that to help not only yourself by strengthening yourself as you go through, but other people who are watching. So if you don't share, honey, what are you doing? If you don't share what you have been through, what you're going through. Now, I know some people, everything ain't meant to be shared. I get that. Everything ain't meant to be shared, right? But the thing that I'm talking about is what you know. Right? You know what I'm talking about. That should be shared, but you just don't want to share it. You just want to hold on to it. But honey, you got to realize that most of the time when you're holding on to that thing, you ain't doing nothing but tearing yourself up inside. Your secrets are making you sick. That's, look, and that's the bottom line. Okay? So anyway, I love y'all. <laughs> I guess, look, if you're new to the room, baby, there comes a time where I cut up on here. I do. I cut up. Um, but it's all in love. Uh, and whenever the spirit speak a little something to me, I go home and say it. That's it. I got to be me. I can't be nobody else. Sharon, that's right. I got to be me. Okay? And look, maybe that's why certain folk don't want to work with me. And guess what? Them ain't the folk that's supposed to work with me. I'm going to be me. I'm going to tell the truth. Uh-oh. Honey, 637. Ha! 20 minutes. Let me check the food again. Let me check it. Hold your mute, honey. Hold your mute. Let's see how she looking. Ooh, wee. All right. I think she need to cook down some more, though. And I want to turn her up a little bit. I think I think whoever had said 400 was right. Because at 375, I wanted to just a little bit longer. So let's do uh, another 15 minutes. Because somebody originally said, that was 20 minutes. So somebody originally said 30 Somebody said 30 to 45. Excuse me. So I think if we do um, another 12. Y'all know how I am with numbers. So 637. How about... What's, what would that be? 647. So let's do 650. I'm going to do 653. Because I can do that if I want to. Okay? So yeah. Oh, man, I just seen somebody said somebody from Reesville, and I missed it. It went up too fast. Hey, Tracy, you know I love you, girl. Hey, girl. Thank you, Stephanie. I love you guys. Oh, where to buy the cheese? Oh, follow your heart cheese. You can get this at Walmart. I mean, not Walmart. I never have seen it at Walmart. Um, Whole Foods. Um, I've seen it at my local grocery stores, too. I almost think... I want to say I've seen it at Target, but I know for sure Whole Foods has it. Um, Vons has it if you out here. Um, I'm trying to remember. I think some of my people on here, help her out, y'all. Kroger, I think, also has this one. I think people have said, I don't have a Kroger out here. And maybe I think some people have said they've seen it at Publix. So um, check and see. But y'all, people who, who are on, in the room, help help our sister out and let her know where she can buy this. But I know for sure here, um, Whole Foods and also Vons, if you're in, if you're in the California area. Um, and then this one, same, the Follow Your Heart Parmesan. Although this one I've had, because this is a big one, it lasts for a while. I've had, they, Follow Your Heart actually sent me this. Um, and I didn't know I still had some. And so I bought some other one today from Whole Foods. Let me show you. I've never had, I've never used it. Um, 
but this one is called Go Veggie. The Go Veggie. Now, you know, they have some Go Veggie sliced cheese that I don't think is actually vegan. But this says vegan. But let's just look at the ingredients because some people are like, that ain't really vegan. So let me just make sure that it ain't got nothing in it we don't supposed to have. Yep, it's vegan. It says contains soy and coconut, but everything in it is vegan. So this one, I, again, I've never tried this one, though. Go Veggie Cheesy Bliss um, Grated Parmesan. And see, this one is really, really fine compared to see how this one is, is a little bit bigger pieces. See the bigger? This one's a little bit smaller. It's like a block in the middle. But this, I know. Honey, this, this thing right here is good. My best friend and goddaughter live in Reesville, North Carolina, and her mama live in Eden. Well, honey, we probably family because, honey, Eden and, and Reesville is where all my family live. Hey, Janita or Janetta Smith from Brooklyn Center, Minnesota. I love you too. Is is a vegan lifestyle expensive? Not for me. I, I'm a bargainista, honey. Ain't no lifestyle gonna be too expensive for me, child. Um, I think if you try to do certain things, it can be expensive. But if you eating a lot of like, no, it ain't ready yet. I just checked it. You gonna stop opening it up my stove? I only opened it two times. I'm honey, choice in here starving. Honey, get you, get you some, get the salad out I made last night, and we're gonna throw the rest of these veggies and stuff, mix it on in there with it, child. Get in here acting like you' about to die, like you ain't ate nothing in yeah. centuries. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> That's right, Lafayette. Always check your ingredients, honey. Even if it say it's one thing, honey, check it anyway. Cause honey, that slide something in on you, honey. We got to be careful. And two, sometimes you just got to be careful. You ain't eating nothing that you might be allergic to, okay? Because sometimes a lot of cheeses and stuff are, are made with um with nuts, and a lot of people have nut allergies, okay? I, myself, um, thank God I don't, but I, I do have a, a terrible milk allergy, which is another reason why vegan uh, being vegan works great for me because I couldn't eat nothing with milk in it no way. Um, oh, Alex, you in uh, Okinawa, Japan, y'all don't have no whole foods. What do y'all have that you can do? That you can get your stuff at? Yes, Japan. I know, right? Honey, I'm going to come over there to Japan. I want to come and visit. You finna put this in your salad? Yeah. Ain't it finna be good? Mm -hmm. We might as well. Oh, what I done got on my face? Oh, child, ain't no telling. Probably some nutritional yeast, child. <laughs> so it's a seasoning facial that I done put together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm throwing all the rest of the stuff in a salad bowl. And mm -hmm. we're going to have salad. With the same ingredients, one raw and one not so raw. Okay, and ain't that all right? You can do that. Really, Charles? Honey, what 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 song um was we singing earlier that you was gonna grace the folk with? Honey, me and Charles had a song in our spirit earlier. Oh, you know you don't want to do right now, huh? Where's Quest? Quest going to the gym with um with my husband? Him and Chance going to the gym. Honey, daddy got to get that workout in, so he take Quest with him. Go on, on to that gym, honey. Let me, look, me and Choice be in here, do a little something. What's going on, Choice? Is the veggies good to you, girl? It's pickle, girl. Oh, that pickle make you dance now. A pickle, a pickle will make you dance. Do your dance. Hey, this pickle, this pickle good. Oh, I made that up. Uh, uh, so anyway, y'all. Jet.com is awesome. Oh, my nails are cute. Thank you. Girl, look. My little graduation nails, child. Thank you. Wait, what's Jet.com? What did I just miss? Ain't that a, um... Honey, I can smell the lasagna. That's why Choice keep coming in here trying to open it up. Hungry. Honey, she, you hear her? Talking about, I'm hungry. I'm honey, hungry. it smells right amazing. I'm going to let y'all smell it in just a minute. I'm going to let y'all smell it, too. Honey, yes, that's exactly what she was singing. I forgot. I didn't know what that song was just now. I When you were singing it to her, somebody said, it's true singing Cardi B, girl. Uh, yes. Didn't I tell y'all earlier to pray for the child? What? But listen, honey, that Cardi took her life and changed it on the ram, didn't she, to something? We got to always keep keep our artists lifted in prayer, child, because it can be a dark, dark place sometimes. 
Okay. Honey, I'm cutting up all this stuff, child. Choice. What? We gonna sing this? You gonna sing the song? <clears throat> God will do what He said He will do. Choice can sing it. My voice ain't that great, as y'all know. But I'll sing whatever the Lord put on my spirit. I said that, that's for somebody. So it's scratchy. God will do what he said he will do. <clears throat> Come on, Choice. Give me something, Choice. Huh? He'll stand by his word. He will come through. Yes. God will do what he said he would do. He will stand by his word. Sing it. Now. That's how it goes. <laughs> That's how it goes. You lost me, Choice. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's how it goes. You lost me. Mom, that's how it goes in the song when the build okay. up. Okay, you built it up, but I was... I will do what he said he would do. He will stand by his love. Yes, he will. He will come through. Oh, you need a choir. Yeah, you're supposed oh, to do the, you're got supposed it. To, you're supposed to be the background. I'm supposed to be the background. My bad. I need to know my role. My bad. Okay, give me. But I'm about to do a different song. Okay, take me to the king then. No, 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 no. no oh, no. you're going to do a different song? Excuse me. He I'm... is mine. And I am his. It, it doesn't, doesn't matter what I did. Because he only sees me. Who I am. You know that y'all. He only see you, you for who it. you are. Sing it one more time with me. I said, He's mine and I'm His. It doesn't matter what I did. Cause He only sees me for who I am. Oh. We missed uh, the beat. We did. The Lord is pleased, though. <laughs> you know, the Lord don't even when when um when you mess up on the on the on the little thing. The Lord, He still be pleased. He said, "You can sing it from your heart. It's all right." Let's see. This is the song right here. Oh, no weapon. No. no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the weapon got formed against us right there. When we try to come into that, the, you see how the weapon formed what? against our voice just no, then. You, you hit that run. No. <laughs> honey, that's that's my husband's song right there, honey. That no weapon. Okay, let me see. <clears throat> let me drink my little water. Let me drink my water. We, honey, <laughs> this is our, um, we waiting on the food to cook. I done, I done made us a little salad right here with the extra veggies and stuff. So we just give, doing a little, um, a little concert, okay? Okay, somebody saw my wind C D coming out. Um see we gotta um oh, we gotta get we gotta get in the stew. So we're gonna hit the no weapon. <coughs> ready? <coughs> okay. You ready, Toys? This nutritional I'm yeast. Start, should I start it in This the is what is making the voice sound good when you sing it into the nutritional yeast. I'm gonna sing you it to the parmesan. Oh yeah, this is salt free, so I know it's gonna be good. You ready? Should I start at the low <coughs> octave or the high? Yeah. I'm gonna follow your lead. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna jump in and harmonize. <coughs> Ready? <clears throat> no weapon formed against me shall prosper. It won't work. No weapon. Formed. You supposed to go up? <laughs> See, I thought. Why are you forming the weapons, Joyce? Why? It's, it's no weapon formed against me shall prosper. It won't work. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. You're supposed to get ugly with it, because if you get oh. uh, ugly, it'll make your voice sound good. Oh. And then you can be like, God oh. will do what he said right. he will do. Like that. Right. 
Oh. Well, I'm gonna go check the food. <laughs> Take it to the oh, 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 oh. It's ready. I think it need to cool. I think it need to cool down. <laughs> I mean, it ain't burning, but you know, it seems like it's juicy. So where my where my thing get? Troy, sing Take Me to the King. <clears throat> Mom, I don't want to sing that. I want you to sing it. Somebody might need it. Sing it, Troy. Take me <sighs> to the King. Truth is, I'm tired. Oh, oh. Truth is, I'm tired. Uh-huh. I don't know what the words are. Options are few. I'm trying to pray. Hold your mute. But where are you? Oh. I'm all churched out. Hurt and abused. Ooh. Lord, have mercy on me, Jesus Christ. Is it ready? We got to let it sit because it's so hot. You know, it's. Y'all got to see this. I had Mom. to push it down a little bit. Mom. You know this is about to be it. Y'all, look at this here. Honey, boom. Okay? <laughs> it's a, a couple pieces of this cheese right here on the top. Got to get down in there. But see how wet it is? That means it's got to sit for a minute. And let it crust up. See, that was y'all telling me put all that extra um, sauce in there. <laughs> see, that's why I didn't really want to put too much... Um, I didn't want to put too much sauce because I knew that that would happen. But since we all in it together, I'm not holding anybody responsible. But what we have to do is, uh, somebody put truth is, choice is tired. <laughs> um, so we're going to let it simmer down. Okay? Okay? We're going to let it simmer down. And choice we're gonna let it simmer down i'm about to eat a salad oh choice grabs her plate <laughs> anyway i'm like what is you doing we let it simmer down so we gotta let it simmer down so it can sit you know get get uh molded together you know take but it smells amazing Mama, take me it's no more pickles in here it's no more pickles oh you know where they at Y'all, I told y'all I had been gone a while and anything was liable to happen tonight on this here live okay so, um, anywho, Jesus. somebody said, wait a minute, I missed the comment. Somebody just said, Thank somebody you. said, I've been taught the word, how to create a delicious meal and laugh all in a matter of an hour. Thank you. Oh, Anicia, thank you, honey, girl. I cuts up, we cuts up in this room, okay? Anything liable to happen when you come on in the room. Oh, wait a minute. Also, what's liable to happen is the battery can die. But zucchini is good. Honey, I know zucchini good. Like wrong. Now you about this vegan life, ain't you? No, I've been about it. Remember, I was mixed. Now she's been mixed. Remember, I told y'all she was mixed, half vegan, half blacky. Uh uh, get on out of there. No, I'm no. You, you need to go out. No, I'm a full breed. Hold your mute, y'all. You need to go out. I see you trying Hello. to see. So what you're going to do is you take your pickle <laughs> and you add pickle to salad. Choice is putting a little um. That's very good. Delicious. Somebody said, if you cook off, you grill zucchini off, it will be last water. I, 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 I Say it again, because I think something happened. <laughs> um, um, somebody just came in and asked for the sprinkle, honey. I gave a full shower earlier, okay? Um, look, go back on to the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> Choice can't give a sprinkle right now. Her phone privileges have been taken. She's working on these grades right now. Right, Choice? Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, that's the sprinkle. Do right <laughs> and be rewarded. Do wrong Jesus. and be taken from. Okay? In the name of Jesus. That's right. Honey, Choice is over here grubbing. I want y'all to know it. The way that she is eating the salad. Um, thank you. Choice, somebody said you, you uh, gorgeous. Julianne, you ain't never had pickles. So Everybody sweet. say a little prayer for Julianne. She ain't never ever had, had pickle. pickle. Who did this to you? Honey, who did who it? Who raised you? I'm so sorry. <laughs> if you grill the zucchini before, it would be less moist. Oh, thank you, Janice. Oh, okay. Well, I believe it'll be all right, won't it? 
grilled zucchini would get the water out. Well, I'll remember that the next time. Look, where was y'all at when I was doing all this? <laughs> Why ain't nobody tell me that an hour ago when they seen me laying the zucchini? Uh-huh. But you know what it is? When you do raw zucchini lasagna, you don't have to grill it. And you don't, it don't, you don't cook it. So I didn't know all that. That's the first time I did it. But good time telling somebody an hour after we didn't cooked it up. <laughs> oh. I love y'all. We all family, ain't we? Yeah. It's all right. Everybody calm down. It's all right. Okay? Um, that's the devil. No pickles. I know. Lord, I, I feel, I'm sorry for you. I'm sorry. Oh, Carolyn, you had jackfruit for the first time tonight. Life got good for you. Was it good? Did, did it get cooked well? Lord, she allergic to cucumbers. Oh, Marquita, you allergic to cu- cucumbers. Girl, that's terrible. God, I, right now, Lord, I ask you to remove that allergy from Marquita, <laughs> Lord. Lord, that ain't nothing but from the pits of hell, God. Please, Lord, bless her, Lord. Remove that allergy out of her system so she can experience the life of a pickle. Amen. And I'm praying in the next uh, couple days or months, honey, that you will be able to eat a pickle. But you know what? If you ain't allergic to carrots or radish, honey, pickle you some radish or pickle you a carrot, honey, mm, life will be changed more abundantly. You'll be living real, real good. Okay? Um, so, let me see. Have you ever made a zucchini crusted pizza? Ooh, I sure ain't, but that sounds like something I might try. Honey, I done left this door open. What what was that? Something just flew in here. What was that? Oh. Oh. Uh, let me close it down. Hello. Ah! Okay, let me check our food again. I mean, it's been sitting not that long. Oh my goodness, mom. Somebody's allergic to avocados. Deasha? Deasha? Girl. Didi, girl. <laughs> you allergic to avocado? Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm sorry. Folk allergic to cucumbers, pickles, and avocado. Mm. The devil is busy. Ooh. I'm going to go into fasting mode for y'all on this thing, honey. We got to get this thing right in the spirit. Okay? Lord, have one into what? Honey, somebody said taste it. How do you pickle carrots? So what you do is, oh well, we cheat with ours. We don't, we don't really pickle them ourselves. Um, we take this up. See, so you see this you here. You know, you see how you, this is a, a jar of pickles. So after you finish with this, then you take some carrots and so whatever other vegetables that you want to pickle, and you put it in there, girl. And you leave it in there for a couple days. Let it soak up real good. And and there you go. You got pickled carrots, pickled rat, red, rat, red. What am I trying to say? Radish. <laughs> and I'm trying to cut this, but it's so watery that I feel like I want to put it back in the oven and let it cook out some of this water, y'all. Can I do that? I know we've been on here for a long time, but can I put it back in the, in the oven? And let it cook out some of the water. Huh? They said that. Look, let me just taste this. Oh! Mm. Mm. Ooh. Y'all. Oh, she can't use the pickle juice if she's allergic. You right. So then you just have to do vinegar, a little bit of salt, lemon juice. Um, what do it say on here? Somebody answer my question. Can I put it back in the oven? Terry Lynn, you right, girl. It ain't cheap. It's smart. Oh, somebody said they pickled an avocado. Say what now? You put it. You pickled an avocado? So how does that work without getting soggy in there? Like, you can't pick it for too long? Well, honey, we don't need it. Put it in there, but a whole day, and then chop it up and put it on top of your salad. But how are you going to take it and put it in a wrap? It? You just going to skin it? Yeah. Chop it up and put it in there. I guess. I feel like I'm down for that. So just drain some of the juice off of the... See if the veggies will cook through. Put it back in the oven. No, the more it cooks, the more water it's going to make. Okay. Okay, let me try to drain some of the juice then. Hold your mule. 
Honey, I told y'all we was in this thing together. Hold your mute. Uh, where, 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 where my little top at? We're Let's all see. in this together. Oh. Y'all don't know that song? Or... Huh? God will do what he said he would do. Oh! I you burned my hand. hand. You burned your hand? Lord Jesus. Mommy. Girl, trying to drain out the juice. Came out from the side that I didn't pay attention to. Is oh, you, you mute. Are you bleeding? No, I ain't bleeding. I just burned my hand. I ain't cut my hand. Well, sometimes if you y'all, this is too watery. If you get a deep Word burn, no, then it'll bleed. Honey, I'm trying, y'all. Hold your mute. It's because it's all vegetables and there's no bread to soak it up, mom, or real pasta. No, I should have did what they said an hour after and grilled the zucchini first. Um, yeah, cause this ain't right. This ain't right, y'all. But it don't it don't taste right. Mm -mm, I think I need to put it back in there. I'm gonna I'm gonna drain some more of this juice, and I'm gonna let it cook a little bit longer. Cause in my spirit, it ain't right. Oh, you mute. So, um, Twyla said, put it on the last rack on broil. Oh, that's a good idea. Now that. I like the sound of that. Hold your mute. That's what we're gonna do. And I do uh hold your mute. Let me chop it back off so it'd be cute, you know, when it come out. So the last rack, put a little bit of cheese back on the top. Like I said, what is going on? Danielle, Danielle said, next time just roll the zucchini in a towel to drain the water off. You don't have to grill it. To drain the water off. Yeah, that's what she said. But I didn't even rinse. I mean, I cut the zucchini fresh. Fresh. So you saying? No, I, take it, put it in the put it in the paper towel. And when you cut it fresh, it drain the water out the zucchini. Oh, I see. Okay, so let me let's see if this right here gonna work, honey. If not, I put some on my plate. But see, it's too runny. See, I put this right here on my plate, y'all. See that? That's too runny, though. I mean, it look all right, but it's too runny. But Chor, look, you know Chor's want to try it anyway. I th See, I think it could even cook a little bit more. Chor's is hot. I saw so I'm blowing it. I don't think it's ready. It smells so good. It smells amazing. Yeah, it smells amazing, okay? Okay, the zucchini make its own water, so you it's good, though, ain't it? But I want it to be a little bit. Um, do you know this is good? Honey. Let, let me try it then. Choice hold the mute now. Choice trying to tear cheese. Trying to tear it all up. Look, we're gonna try it yeah. anyway. Look, even though it's still we got it back in the oven, but go ahead, go, go. It's a baking glass pan. Mmm. Oh. Oh. Wait, this was this was mm. my fork. Um, mm. This fork. This mm. fork. The fork. It was. Oh. Right. Mm. Baby. You everything was mine. Wait a minute, Troy. Honey, y'all. It might not have looked like nothing because of the, the, the honey. Mom, that is, that's it. <sighs> Woo! Who? Honey. Oh. Honey, you can't judge the book by the cover, honey. It look like it won't gonna be right. But honey, when I tell you that thing is right, dynamite right. Mm. That's so good. Why you eating it all, Choice? I made the plate for me originally. No. Yep. No. You, <laughs> you better stop fighting me. Give me stop. a little bit of that spinach, girl. You ought to be ashamed. <laughs> Y'all. 
Thank you. This right here. Yes, God. What's in it? It tastes like meat. Oh, we use a couple of them um them crumbles. The Tuscan sweet earth crumble. Honey, we didn't deal it. It's in the oven though. It's in the oven. Hold. It's on the grill. So I told to put it on the grill. I'm gonna put it in there for about five more minutes. But honey. Baby, you turn. Baby, to we done learned a lesson. Next time, Best grill the zucchini thing. first, get all the water out of it. Best thing I But then throw that thing all together like I did. Honey, put all them layers of uh veggies and cheese and seasonings in there. And you got a zucchini pasta, uh, uh, zucchini lasagna, zucchini herbs and veggies. Casserole. And casserole, whatever you want to call it. But right now, it looked like I had zucchini and water. <laughs> so I had to fix that thing up in there. Babe, Ooh, this thing is it's good. It's so much better when you take it out. Honey, it's good. Look, I would lick the plate, but I don't want y'all to see that part of me. She about to lick the plate in the corner, Lord. Oh, So anyway, I miss you too, Eddie. I'm so glad you back on in this room. Um, I've been gone for about a week uh, or, or off and on because I've been traveling and things. But I'm back for about a week or two. We're going to be in this room on and off for the next two weeks with y'all. Um, I got a whole lot of stuff coming. A bunch of announcements. I'm traveling a lot. Uh, I'm going to be in L.A. this weekend in Lamarck Park at the Memorial Day um, Mom, they say don't let it burn. Oh, thank you. You see her? Not even paying Ooh, honey, attention. It's coming honey, it's coming yeah. together. It ain't burning, honey. You see this? You see this that I got? I got this for her. Troy's got me a new water for bottle Mother's for Mother's Day. Day. But let me tell you what the gag is. Cause y'all know I go hiking, right? So. And it be hot out there on the mountain. So this right here is a spray bottle. This puts mist in my face when I get hot. Ain't that nice? No, I'm not going to do it. But but that's what it do. That's what it do. Did you try it already? Yeah, me and Nick used it. Oh, you y'all went on a hike. I did it at the gym just so I could show oh. it. Oh. Y'all want to see it? Mom, mom. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's how that work. <laughs> it's water. Oh. Well, well, well. Took muscle some weight. Oh, you. <laughs> After it was already on your face. Mom is still watery. I see it slithering sl yeah. around. I'm gonna, let there. It, I'm gonna let it sit. We didn't try take a syringe. And get the juice. Uh-uh. 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 I mean, we know it's going to be good, so... And then you can some put it in it. a bowl. Yeah, but... Well, I know that some of the water then came out of it. So, I'm going to just let it sit. Oh, what's in the salad? Oh, I was I was out eating oh, it we, hard. I mean, you just threw that salad on the yeah. honey. So, in our salad, we have... Dang, you had a whole bunch of salad because it was... A no, that's how much it was. Mixed um, romaine. We have romaine lettuce. Oh, this actually might have, be iceberg because I didn't buy no romaine. We have I we have lettuce, onions, um, red peppers, green peppers, zucchini, some um, cucumber, and pickle. Mushroom. Where is it at? Oh, those I had left over that we threw oh, in there. Oh, and some mushrooms. And um, that's it. Oh, you ate all that. I ate all the avocado out. Yeah. Oh, and there was some black olives in there. It was, and they was good. Oh, you know what? I'm not gonna throw the rest of them in there. So, cause I had them left over. Yes. <laughs> oh wait. Oh, say can you see the black olives in my salad? And I'm gonna shake it up. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then I'm gonna eat it. All right now, all right now. And when I swallow. Yeah, 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 yeah. It feels so good in my tummy. Yeah, you should have said throat right now. 
right there. When I when I swap now. <laughs> is it you, you you writing the song? I just that would have worked. Throat <clears throat> would have worked right there. Wouldn't throat and, would work right there? Where did uh, the can is gone? Anyway, y'all, excuse me, moi. Toys. Um, well, we didn't ate one plate of the uh, runny version of the zucchini lasagna. We had technical difficulties uh, or water difficulties tonight. Um, Centauri, you said where's Blackie? He's sitting right here, honey. Blackie. Um, don't get him too close to this food and stuff right here. Um, we had a little technical difficulty, but you seen we tow up that plate. Uh, so you know if it's runny and good, baby, when that thing settle and sit, it's gonna be damn right amazing. Okay, so, uh, oh, Choice can sing. She just playing with y'all. The girl can sing. You know that's what she gonna do with her life. She gonna sing. be a singer. Blackie, Blackie. I told you, see, see Blackie. I told y'all ever since that possum fight, he been that, he been like that, barking at folk he know, his daddy in, in Quest. It's my husband in Quest. Hey, buddy. Oh, you trying to hide? Oh, where is Quest? Quest, where did Quest go? Hello. Hey, anybody over there seen Quest? Huh? Oh no. Nah. Oh, Blackie went out. Didn't y'all hear me? I had to take him out earlier. Here, stand right here so folk can see you. Hola. Hola, cómo está? Muy bien. He says, how are you? Costa. <laughs> how, 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 do you, how, how do you do how are you in sign language? Ooh, mommy don't know in sign language. Choice, do you remember? How are you in sign language? I know how to spell it out with your fingers. But we can spell it out. Wait. Honey, Blackie ran and got his toy because he want to play with, with Quest as soon as he came in. Husband. Yeah, man. Hey. Hey. Y'all hear my husband is home. Back from the gym. Hey, oh, I didn't know that was on, babe. He came straight in to turn the Cleveland game on. So anyway, um, <clears throat> look, still over there sitting. We didn't learn that. Just hit me with that. Every, hey, 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 hey! Don't play with that around the, the, in the kitchen first or around no food, okay? Um. So we didn't learn tonight. If we're gonna do this spaghetti squash, I mean not spaghetti squash, zucchini. Um. We need to grill it first, get all the water out of it, right? Then we lay it on out, unless you want to make it raw, which it might be something else I do when we do another raw challenge. Um, but then you layer that sucker up with all your ingredients that you like, okay? Wow. And baby is good, okay? Wow. Yes, yes. Why are we going to watch this? Um, you know what? Whenever we get some time. We got it now. It's ours. You can watch whatever you want. Can I watch this? Well, you know what? Do you have the, I don't know if Dad has the thing hooked up in your room. We'll have to see if we can hook it up in your room or maybe in the back. What time is it, though, buddy? You got to get a bath. It's a little too late to watch it tonight. Because you're going to have to get a bath, you're going to have to eat, and then go to bed because you got school tomorrow. Okay? Yep, Mama's going to fix your plate in just a minute, all right? So. But, Mom, how am I going to watch this? Huh? But I'm watching Buddy, did you hear what Mom just said? Did you, are you listening? Okay. All right. Thank you. So, y'all. Oh, Tiffany. Or oh, cut it a little thicker. That's also. So, what I do, now that we know, honey, a recipe has been born. I Look, once it cooled down, y'all see somebody back over there in the plate, though, right? I, cu I put all the things, the ingredients, I put the recipe on, on uh, in the body of the message on the top of this video so that y'all will know. Okay? Or maybe when it cooled down. Look, or tomorrow if any is left, I'll take a cute little picture of it and then post a the recipe. One or the other or all both of them, we're going to get a recipe out of this thing. All right? Anywho, I absolutely love y'all. Um, yes, buddy. I've seen it. Yeah. And I thank y'all for hanging in. Uh-uh. I got it this time. No, I didn't. I'm going to get it, though, before the night is over. Um, I absolutely love you. Thank you for hanging on in there with me for however long. We've been on here about two hours, ain't we? Has it been that long? We've been on here for quite some time. Somebody said, Choice, you called. What you do, Choice? Oh, yeah, because you was in my pan back there. Yeah. Salad dressing. Choice used, um, on that, she was using zesty Italian. But I, 
Ooh, this weekend, my new favorite is Just Ranch. Oh, no, I'm going to do a video. I told him I'm going to surprise him with the video later. Um, So, anywho, I forgot what else we were saying. But, yeah, somebody said you can broil the zucchini first, then place it on a paper towel, and it takes the water out. So, all of that good stuff, okay? And somebody said they're going to send me the pickled avocado information. Please do. If you already did, I thank you. Oh, I absolutely said, love y'all. What? What? She asking if you can hold the nutritional yeast. Oh, nutritional uh, so yeast. She oh. screenshot it. There you go. You got it? But it's backwards that way. Let me see if I can flip it over for her. Um. Hold your mute. Right here. Nutritional yeast by Bragg. Okay. All right, you got it? Okay. So, if y'all cook it, let me know. But remember those tips. So, we don't have, you don't have too much water in it like me. But see, you know me, honey, I eat it as a soup if I have to. But as soon as that thing cool off just a little bit more, I'm going to tear it up and you better believe it. Okay? So, again, thank y'all so much for hanging in there with me. Stay tuned for announcements. Um, more locations have been added. Honey, I'm traveling. I'm doing things in the community here in L.A., um, Orlando, I'll be there in two weeks. Um, North Carolina, I'm coming home again. Uh, I'll make that announcement in a little bit. Chicago, y'all already know I'm on the way. Minneapolis, hang on, here I come, okay? I love y'all. Thank y'all again. Honey, tonight, I pray you have a good night. Honey, and tomorrow, I pray that you have a good day. But baby, if you can't have a good one, don't go messing up nobody else's. Ain't it cute? I love y'all. Bye.